Ever found yourself staring at the dreaded Xbox app error code 0xd05e0125? This error can occur for a variety of reasons, from an interrupted download to temporary glitches or even the Xbox system being down. First things first, if you've just encountered this error, try the simplest solution. Reboot your PC and internet and give downloading another go. If the error persists, then it's time to roll up our sleeves and get to work. The first fix involves repairing the Gaming Services app and the Xbox app. Navigate to your Settings, then Apps, and select Apps Features. From here, select Gaming Services and choose the Advanced Options. From this menu, select the Repair option. Repeat the same process for the Xbox app, and then try installing again. Still encountering the error? The second fix might be the one for you. This involves reinstalling the Gaming Services app. Start by choosing the search icon on your taskbar, then enter PowerShell. Right-click on Windows PowerShell and choose Run as Administrator. In Windows PowerShell, type the following command and hit Enter. Get AppX Package Microsoft Gaming Services Remove AppX Package Alusers. Then install the app from the page that opens up, restart your PC, and see if the error is resolved. If the error is still persisting, we have a third fix. Again, go to PowerShell as an administrator and type in the following command, get AppX package, all users vertical bar, for each, add AppX package, disable development mode, register, dollar, dollar underscore install location, AppX manifest ML. If you've tried all the above and the error is still sticking around, it might be time to try disabling your antivirus or firewall completely. After doing this, restart your PC and see if the error is resolved. Finally, if all else fails, it might be worth checking the Xbox system status. If the Xbox system is experiencing issues, this might be the root cause of your error. In summary, the Xbox app error code 0xd05e0125 can be quite a nuisance, but it's not unbeatable. By following these steps you can troubleshoot your way through it. Remember, start with a simple reboot, then try repairing the gaming services app and Xbox app. Reinstalling the Gaming Services app, using PowerShell commands, disabling your antivirus or firewall, and finally checking the Xbox system status. Hopefully one of these solutions will get you back in the game. If you like this information, don't forget to subscribe, and for more tech updates visit queries.com.